Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with the NK. Stay frosty. So we're back at Yoshinoya Japanese Kitchen for today's review to check out their take on an iconic American Chinese food menu favorite. And if it looks half as good as how it's being advertised on the window, this should be pretty awesome. And as you just saw, it's their orange chicken looking nicely sauced up and ready to go. Definitely digging the presentation on this one for sure. It looks very, very inviting. Now for the two of you who may not know what orange chicken is, it happens to be one of the most popular dishes you can get at just about any Chinese fast food spot out there. They're pretty much going to offer something like this on the menu. It's white meat chicken that's battered up and fried to a crispy golden brown and then tossed into some type of orange sauce. Either it features sweetness, spiciness, tanginess, or a combination of the three. It's basically a favorite known around the country. And a lot of peeps love it. And considering how this looks from Yoshinoya, I think I'm gonna get into this pretty nicely. So let's see if this one delivers on all of those things, or maybe some of them. Guys, this is their orange chicken over here at Yoshinoya. Let's peep out this flavor. Yeah, this definitely looks like orange chicken done right. Check out the generous amount of that orange sauce all throughout this one. And the smell is nice and sweet in the car right now. Let's dive in. And it looks like they give you a pretty decent amount in the bowl, aside from the fact that it doesn't really look like the picture with that whole mound on the very top here. And I got to admit, the white rice in the bottom looks a little on the light side. But let's just get into it right now and try this flavor. I'm really digging how it smells. Pieces are fairly decent, some small, some medium, a couple of big ones. Here we go, it's the orange chicken returning here to Yoshinoya with the first time for me. Let's do it. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Nice, lightly fried pieces of chicken that are actually more chicken than batter, which is really nice. A little bit of sweetness from that sauce like I was expecting. And then you're getting a nice little bit of tang coming up on the back end. This is a little bit different compared to the other versions of this that I've had, but I like it, guys. It definitely feels a little bit lighter on top of it. Let's keep going. Oh, yeah. Lots of white meat chicken on the inside of this. Let me bring it in here for the close-up. Take a look at that. Not a bad meat to coating ratio as far as I'm concerned. I'd probably say it's maybe 45% meat, 55% coating, but overall a very, very hearty bite as I'm getting into it. And then the sauce is really delivering a nice amount of tang, a nice amount of sweetness, and very little sizzle, but it's definitely flavorful and it really does taste like it's orange. Really nice. But unfortunately, like I was suspecting, as I'm kind of digging through this, there's really not too much white rice in here, guys. So the price point is a little elevated for what I got right now, even though the flavor is really good on the orange chicken. But I wish I had a little bit more rice to go with everything. Let me actually grab that piece that I just showed you with some of the white rice and give that a go, because that really is the classic pairing as far as I'm concerned. Let's go. Mm. That is awesome. Really good. The stickiness of that rice along with the stickiness of the actual orange sauce itself, which is really beginning to come out right now. It almost tastes like an orange peel. It's really tasty. A little bit of sizzle coming up on the back end, but nothing to write home about. But it's really all about the sweetness and the tanginess of it. And I really dig how the combination works. So white rice is really the recommendation if you guys get this at Yoshinoya. Just do the bowl with white rice. You can get this in many other different ways, as you're probably seeing on the screen right now, whether it's a regular bowl, a large bowl, a combo bowl, or anything in between, really. Hey, as good as all of that is, you can't really beat the classic pairing of white rice and orange chicken together, just to really get into the full flavor of everything this one has to offer on its own, because it really is good at Yoshinoya. It really is. Mmm. And again, I really like how it feels very light and airy, even though it is a fried piece of chicken, technically. I really like how the flavor is on this. Let me take a quick bite of this large piece over here. We'll go for one final close-up, and then we'll wrap this one up. Mmm. Take a look at this piece. Pretty much solid white meat all throughout here, guys, with a very nice amount of light coating around it. This is pretty much neck and neck, and I have to say, this bite right now is probably the best in the group so far. Nicely done on this one, and I have to say, I will easily be getting this again. Very delicious, especially with their version of the sauce. Nicely done, Yoshinoya. Okay, so the white rice may have been a little lacking and the price point may have been a little elevated for what I got today, but overall the flavor delivers and that's exactly where it counts. The quality is very high on that and I have to admit, it's probably some of the best fast food type of orange chicken I've ever had. And I only say that because of all the pieces that I've had so far for this review, it seems pretty consistent with the amount of meat that you're getting compared to the coating. And that's a huge plus on top of the flavor of the sauce itself, which is really nice. So as for the overall rating, I'm gonna have to give the orange chicken here at Yoshinoya Shinoya Japanese Kitchen, a highly recommended 8.8 out of 10. Like I mentioned earlier, the only real knocks against this one are the fact that I didn't get enough white rice in the bowl to justify the above average price point for what I got. But what I did get, don't get me wrong, was very flavorful, definitely tasty, but maybe a dollar two more than it should have been considering it's just one item on a bed of white rice. But still, I would get this one again. Now the question is, would you give it a shot if you haven't tried it yet over here at Yoshinoya? Drop some comments down below. Let me know what you thought of this version based upon my review today. And if you guys are fans of orange chicken in general, who do you 
you think makes it the best? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another episode of Peep This Out, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why you stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Hey everyone, by the time this review goes live, we should be right up on Thanksgiving. So let me take a quick moment to wish each and every one of you a very happy Thanksgiving. Absolutely enjoy all the amazing eats with family and friends. And without a doubt, look forward to more fun content a little bit later this weekend. So enjoy yourselves. And until next time, I'll talk to you soon.